Hi, here's a current porch renovation I'm working on. So, um, we've had double doors fitted inside. Um, I've piped up, sorry, I've boxed up all the pipe work, as you can see. Um, the initial architrave, which is here, that was actually a plastic frame. It was about as wide as that. Um, so I had that removed using a multi-cutter. Um, and I've just fitted the architrave I've got around the rest of the house. Let me open the doors. Okay, we had double doors fitted to the front of the house as well. So I've got the um, got electrics in here. Um, had an isolator fitted, as you can see. So you can have a. We've got a socket outside. It's all the tap as well. We have an isolator, so you can turn it off. Um, the floor was actually lower. So I've raised that up, so I've bought some timber, I had some, I've increased the height of the actual floor to make it fairly level uh, with the rest of the house so it flows. Um, I put a doorbell in obviously so there's a cable coming in so I need to buy some conduit so, and I need to tidy up the wiring. So, oh, also to mention, I've had a round window fitted. Um, so I've had to smooth off this area. Obviously they came, they fitted it, and obviously they couldn't plaster it smoothly enough. So I've plastered it, and it's quite tricky getting the actual level. So I've used filler, and rubbed the filler in like so. Um, and then got some water and a scraper like that. Just gradually worked around. And once it was tidy, let it dry and then sanded it down. Also, we've fit the light like so. Uh, we have some light in here if we need to turn it on. That cable's going to be put in conduit to tidy it up, so I'll have it going all the way along and then down there into that junction area. So let me carry on with this, and then the next job after the conduit's in is to tile the floor. So I'll show once that's in place. Let me show briefly the doors. Okay, so the wiring's been tidied up now in the porch. You can see conduit is in. And what I might do to blend it in a bit more is um, PVA around the area and then paint straight over it. So what I did after I stuck the conduit down, um, I put no nails glue around it, let that dry and then decorate its cork. It's not too bad. So now what I'm doing, I'm starting the, um, the floor just securing that. So I've marked where the beams are and just put in a few screws in just to secure it so there's no movement. Okay, I'll carry on with that. And I'll show the next stage in a moment. Okay, so here we have 
porch um, just painted up now so what I did is with the conduit um, just to blend it in a little bit more just PVA'd it and just painted on top of it a couple of coats of paint and I'm not sure how clearly you can see this but it's been in. make it seem more part of the ceiling okay so the next thing I'll just move the cardboard that was in the way um, and I'm just gonna PVA the floor and then I can start tiling straight on top of it so it's chipboard floor um, a few gaps at the edges and stuff no biggie I can just take it up close and then um, just fill it with some silicon or decorated cork. There you go, let me PVA that. And I'll lay down the first, well, first two tiles I think is, I can put down, the rest will all have to be cut. Okay, I've stuck down the first two tiles. Obviously used levelers and some spacers. The floor actually slopes off towards the front door, so downwards. Um, I was gonna try and level it, but the only issue is if it comes up too high, once I put the mat on there, um, it might scrape the mat, so it will come up quite high to be honest. So um, I thought I'd just keep it, the slight gradient on there still, but it's level going across anyway, so no biggie really. So there you go, first two tiles down. Um, so the good thing is obviously you get the first two down and then when you cut the others, obviously these won't move out of place so it should give a good starting point. So there you go, not too many to do. Um, and I guess uh, just four large ones, one, two, three and four and just two slightly thinner ones. There you go, let me continue later on and I'll film the results. Alright, so here we have the area tiled now. So I've got the levelers in there and I just need to push them off, well knock them off and then I can start the grouting. So I'll leave that now for a good few hours and I'll pull them off and probably grout tomorrow now. Okay, here we have the tiles now grouted. Just about to clean it up. Okay. The routed tiles are now cleaned up. Did a bit of painting on the areas. I've got some grout, so just waiting for that to dry up. So there you go. So here we have the finished porch area now. I fit some um, shelves. So we've got shoe storage. There's another video on how I did that one. There you go. Thanks for viewing.